What are we talking about? We're talking about this game. Top seeded Dylan, ranked number one in 3A, taking on Xavier Thomas. We all know what that young man is going to bring to the table. And Wilson Tigers actually reeling a little bit as of late, starting off really good, and then they've lost the last two, trying to get back into the swing of things against, well, a very good Dylan team who's won four straight state championships. There's Xavier, the only captain on the field for the, for the, uh, for the Tigers tonight. And very first possession, Tyler Johnson. He's going to keep it and pick up some big yardage uh, right through the teeth of that Wildcat defense, but the drive stalls. Dylan's first possession, Johnny Allen, right up the middle. Oh, yeah, he uh, grabbed an offer for Purdue just recently, and here's a reason why, because he's a good player. Hawkins is going to hit Josh Leach, and then Xavier is just going to nail Leach, and yeah, unfortunately, uh, Jackie's not really quite liking what he sees there. Allen needed some water because uh, right after that, he's going to get right back into it and get back in the swing of things. Hawkins, the deep pass, right on the money. That is one heck of a throw. That's why this kid is a four-star with talent written all over him. Next play up the middle, Johnny Allen yet again down to the six-yard line. A few plays later, Wildcats looking to go ahead and get on the board. And it's Allen one more time. And oh, yeah, he finds the Easter egg. Dylan goes on to win this one 37 to nothing over Xavier and Wilson as the uh, Wilson Tigers have dropped three consecutive and dropped to two and three. Dylan improves to three and one heading into their big matchup with Marlboro County next Friday. As for Wilson, we mentioned it, West Florence at Memorial next week.